testing. Testing one, two, three. Baby, it's cold outside. Okay, let's get started here making eggnog. I love eggnog so much and it is that time of year. It is cold outside and so I want to be doing eggnog shots all day long. So let's get started on this super basic recipe. It's gonna take just a second to make and you're gonna love it. I used to be barista at Starbucks. It was my favorite time of year when the eggnog would come out. I would do eggnog shots all day long every day and I basically couldn't fit in my pants within like a week. Anyway, I this year wanted to come out with a keto paleo eggnog that you can make at home that is healthy. It's essentially a fat bomb that you are gonna love. I forgot to get my eggs so hold on just a second. Okay, so first we have one cup of hot almond milk. I really love Califia Farms uh, toasted coconut almond milk. It is so delicious. I've got a teaspoon of um, coconut oil. For a while I was doing MCT oils in this recipe, but girlfriend over here is a little broke right now. So we're going with coconut oil. You can still get some good MCTs in coconut oil. So that's what we're gonna do. And then we're gonna do one scoop of vanilla collagen. I love the sports research brand. And I love the vanilla collagen in this eggnog recipe because they sweeten it with monk fruit so it does give it that nice sweet taste that eggnog has that we all love. And then I use some nutmeg and some cinnamon if you have some cinnamon. My cinnamon's over there and I'm plugged into my mic so I'm not going over there right now, but you could do cinnamon. You could add some vanilla. Again, my vanilla's over in the cupboard, not prepared, surprise, surprise. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you've got your one cup of almond milk. You could do one and a half cup of almond milk. You've got your one scoop of vanilla collagen powder. You've got your nutmeg. If you're seed cycling, this would be a great time to add in the seeds that you need for whatever phase of your cycle you're in. So we're gonna start our blender, raise up the speed. We're gonna take our little lid off here. Once we get to a high enough speed, we're gonna drop a raw egg in. You wanna make sure your blender's high enough so that you don't scramble the egg, you want it to blend in. It's going to make it so unbelievably rich and creamy, you're gonna be shocked. Ah! Don't do that. Okay, it is ready to be poured and enjoyed. If you try this recipe, I know that you're going to love it. This is so healthy. You've got the amazing healthy fats from the egg. You've got the protein, you've got the collagen, which is amazing for your skin, your hair, your joints, and there's no sugar. And you have the MCT from the coconut oil, which is amazing for your brain function and so many other things. And so check this out. Let me see if I can come on up here. You can see my ring light up in that mug. Look at that eggnog. Oh my golly, this looks amazing. Oh, I'm drooling. This is just like back in the day. When I worked for Starbucks, I was this little cute barista. Didn't stay little for long when it was eggnog season. And we're gonna do a little sprinkle because I'm a barista. Let's try this. So good. Anyway, this is so good. There's a little left. I don't know why I did that. What I love about adding the coconut oil is, I think it's actually the coconut and the egg it becomes so creamy and you've got this gorgeous froth do you see this froth like all of that is just this beautiful silky foam it is amazing so if you're looking for an eggnog recipe that is healthy that's going to give you energy in the afternoon curb your sugar cravings and not make you gain weight this is an amazing recipe to add in and i'll also just say I've been drinking this all summer. I was like, why wait for eggnog season if I can have it all year round and it can be healthy for me. Make sure your eggs are free range, organic if you can. Mine are not. Well, it's free range. I've got the Nellies. Look how cute this little Nellies box is. Maybe I should say drink at your own risk. I drink this all the time and I'm fine. So I think you're gonna be fine. Make sure to comment below and let me know if you try this recipe and you like it. I love hearing from you guys. Have an amazing day, enjoy your nog, and stay warm and cozy because it is cold outside.